the demise of the traditional free offer. Who? Me, Marty Bostic. What's this video about? Getting better results from free offers. Why? It's simple to do and a no-brainer to implement. Hi there. This video is short, to the point, has no headlines, personal stories, or any kind of fancy graphic. It's fluff free and solves one specific problem I know a lot of people have when it comes to generating high quality leads. This is not a video in generating free traffic. It is, however, a simple approach to getting higher conversions on your squeeze pages, generating higher quality subscribers who you're giving a lot of value to, and also helping you get higher open rates in the process. I'm not going to blow you away with a fantastic blitzing new strategy that no one has ever heard of. In fact, what I'm going to talk about is very obvious, although I see very few people actually taking the time to do it right. So what do I mean when I say the demise of the traditional free offer? I certainly don't mean that giving away freebies on your squeeze pages is dead. That would be stupid, of course. So consider this. How many free reports have you downloaded over the years on squeeze pages that actually gave you a lot of value? Not many. I bet you've downloaded dozens of free offers that you've never even consumed, right? Me too. I just don't place any value on what I see being offered on squeeze pages anymore. Once in a while I might come across something unique that tickles my fancy, but most often it's just the same old story. Another freebie I don't expect to get much value from. This is the way most people feel when they see another offer on a squeeze page. I don't know about you, but I don't want people signing up to my email list with low expectations on the value they expect to receive. This is just one of the reasons open rates are so low when it comes to email marketing. There are many other variables to consider, but your offer plays a huge part in the process. It's the first piece of content your new subscriber is going to receive from you, so it better be good. Consider this. 25% of products purchased inside the JVZoo marketplace are never consumed. Isn't that an incredible statistic? That means 25 out of 100 people who buy products don't even bother going in to download the product. With this in mind, how many people can we expect to bother consuming our free offers we give away on our squeeze pages? Unfortunately, a lot of people I see building email lists are focused on the number of subscribers they're getting, but fail to look at how many of these people are consuming the free offer they give away. This is something you seriously have to think about. If people are not bothering to consume your content, they're not going to bother opening your emails, right? Think of all the time, energy, and money you're putting into building your email list. Doesn't it make sense to take every precaution to make sure you get as many people as possible to consume your content? That's just one part of the puzzle, though. We want high conversions on our squeeze page. We want our offer to stand out. We certainly want our subscribers to consume our content. We want happy subscribers. And we want to deliver value. In most cases, a free report just doesn't cut the mustard. People just don't place any significance on the value of a free report anymore. Not in all cases, but in most cases for sure. Be honest, do you value free reports as much as you used to? I bet you don't. In fact, I'll bet you place very little value on free reports these days. Especially the ones we see being peddled on every bloody squeeze page we land on. We become insulated. It's been done to death. The effectiveness of free reports has dramatically decreased over time and it's just common sense it was going to end up that way. Now don't get it twisted. This is a free report slash video you're reading or hearing right now, so I'm not going to say that we should just stop creating them all together. On the contrary, it all comes down to presentation, really. So what's the best way to stand out, give value, generate high conversions, and build trust with your new subscribers? Quite simply, you create an offer so valuable that anyone who lands on your squeeze page will find it almost impossible to turn down. It's not rocket science, but how many people in your niche are actually doing this? I guarantee there are very, very few. A simple change in your approach, though, can have dramatic results. You obviously get higher conversions because the offer is different and much more valuable than a free report. 
you spend less money on traffic because of the higher conversions. If the offer is a really great one, it takes less effort to get people on your page. Create higher expectations inside the mind of your new subscriber. A free report doesn't excite people as much anymore, but a solid free offer can get them really excited. You eradicate the problem of people giving you fake email addresses. You have a significantly higher chance of your freebie being consumed. Remember the JVZoo statistic? You build more trust by giving more value. You have a much better chance of your subscribers actually remembering you. For instance, higher open rates of your emails. As I said, it's not rocket science, but are you doing it? Or are you just following the herd and doing what everyone else is doing? Look. You've more than likely been told to just create a simple squeeze page with just a headline, an opt-in form, and to give away a simple free report. That's fine. Maybe you're already getting high conversions on your squeeze page this way, but high conversions do not tell the whole story. For instance, getting a lot of subscribers is pretty much useless if those people are not getting value from your free offer. Chances are a large portion are not even reading the report. And if they're not reading your report, why would they open your emails? Most people are not expecting to get much value from a free report anyway. They have low expectations when they sign up because they've signed up for probably hundreds of free reports in the past. Free reports are not dead. They're just not as effective as they once were. What you want to do is give them something a little different. Give them something of real value. Give them something to actually be excited about. Give them a reason to believe their contact details are being exchanged for something much more significant. First impressions now more than ever are very important. Everyone's doing the same bloody thing. And people these days who land on squeeze pages are opting in out of curiosity and not because they expect to get value. It's really a joke and it's not hard to see why responsiveness of email subscribers have decreased over the years. In fact, most people signing up for free offers are doing so because they're addicted to downloading offers they have no intention of consuming. You want your new subscribers to feel good about signing up to your email list. You want them to expect to get value, not hope to get value. You want them to be eager to consume your free offer, and you want them to know they've just been given a lot of value. At least that way, there's a much better chance they'll remember who I am. Listen. When was the last time you felt excited when signing up on a squeeze page to get a freebie? Probably your first few days online, right? What about now, though? Still feel excited? How many marketers do you even remember after signing up to their email list? When was the last time you downloaded a free offer, consumed the content, and got a lot of value? It rarely happens, doesn't it? But why? Why does everyone just keep doing what's been done a million times previous? Is it because it works? Maybe. But most often it's because it's just the easy option. Remember, your free offer must be so valuable that anyone landing on your squeeze page will find it almost impossible to turn down. When they enter their contact details into your sign up form, you want them to have high expectations on receiving something of value. The higher the expectations, the higher the chance of them actually consuming the content. When they consume the content, you want them to be blown away by the value you've given them for free. You want them to remember you. You want them to see your name inside their inbox and open your emails based solely off of that alone. You want them to think, geez, imagine what Marty's pay content's going to be like. This should be blatantly obvious to you now. Giving away a free report is not the best option anymore. It just doesn't have the same effect it once had. Isn't it about time you've done things a little different? I mean, it doesn't take much more effort to put together a great freebie. Besides, even if it does take you a little bit longer and takes a little bit of extra effort, the fact is your freebie will be there for a very long time on your squeeze page. The benefit of taking a little extra time to create something of real value could be the difference in earning a thousand, maybe tens of thousands of dollars in extra income over the years. Worth it? If you know anything about the content I share, you'll know I'm a big believer in going against the majority. The majority are almost always wrong. 
So what's required of you to create a stunningly great free offer that's almost impossible to turn down? Well, giving lots of content, 50 free reports, for example, is not going to do it. That will definitely add to the overwhelming feeling most people are suffering with at the moment. So, more doesn't mean better. The goal is simple. I want to give you something different and much more valuable than just a free report. Even if one single report has valuable content in it, the chances of everyone consuming the single report are very slim indeed. Use your imagination to come up with unique ways to bundle the content into a format that's different than what everyone else is doing. It's not really difficult at all. For example, rather than giving away your free report, get a microphone and read the report out loud and record your voice using Audacity or some other free program. Yes, an audio version of a free report is good enough to stand apart from the competition, and an audio version is much more valuable and very, very easy to create. Give away the report as well as the audio version so people can consume the content in the car, washing the dishes, or going to bed. You get my point, yes? Or do you? It's simple. Create something so valuable that people will find it almost impossible to turn down. That's it. Brainstorm ideas. It'll be well worth it. This very simple strategy ensures you get higher conversions on your squeeze page. You provide more value than the competition. Your offer is much easier to promote. You stand out from everyone else just by giving a free report. You also have a much better chance of building a relationship with your subscribers very early in the process of your email marketing campaign. More importantly though, you're giving your new subscribers every reason to believe you over deliver. That's something very few others are doing. So thank you. All the best. Marty.